Today we're going to have a Python quick tip. Uh, I'm going to run Python uh, just from the console here. Obviously, though, all this will work in a script, which is probably where you will use it in many circumstances. Uh, and I'm going to create a variable. I'll call it my string, and we'll set my string equal to hello world. Now we want to see if it's true or false if a certain word is inside that string. And we're going to look at two different ways of doing it. Both work. One's a little bit cleaner than the other. I'm going to say if uh, my string, there we go. So if my variable, we'll say dot find. So it's going to look through that using the find function of the string. And we're going to say hello. So it's going to look for the word hello. And we're going to say if it does not equal negative one, then we're going to say print the words yay. So now if I hit enter, if the word hello is inside my string, which it is, it will print the word yay. So it should if I did everything right. There we go. We get the word yay. Um, now, to look at another way of doing that, which is a little bit cleaner, we're going to say, uh, we already have the string created, we're going to say if hello in my string colon print yay. And since the word hello is in that string, once again, we should see the word her yay. So yay. So as you can see, two different ways of doing the same thing. Uh, but if you look at this compared to this, this is a little bit simpler, a little bit cleaner. Um, now, uh, of course, you can do other things with the if statement in both cases. You can say if this, if it does, then, then print yay, else print boo or something. Um, but I just want to show you that if we change this, to say, hey, so like if it said, hey world. So if the word hey is in my string, then print yay. And in this case, we won't get any output because the word hey is not in there. And although we can say that the word hello is in there and print yay, remember it is case sensitive. So if we change this H to a lowercase h or any of the other letters to capital letters and we try to print it out, we're not gonna get the yay output because of the case sensitiveness. So keep that in mind. Um, and I hope you found this quick tip for Python useful. Um, there'll be a link in the description. Check that out to my website, filmsbychris.com. That's Chris with a K. Uh, and I just hope that you have a great day.